I just couldn't help myself. I decided to keep playing immediately afterwards, so this is not very far after the last video. Uh, I haven't even uploaded the previous video yet. I should probably start that. Hold on, let me at least start the upload. Uh, YouTube upload video. Okay, now it's at least uploading. So. Um, let me go over what I've done for leveling. Um, first off, I've bumped her up to Bodybuilding 4 and Merchant 10. And the reason for this is that, one, I'm starting to need more and more money, so it's a good idea to have somebody with higher Merchant skill. Two, she keeps getting hit by those um, Power Liches. And... Mm, no. No. Um, she's going to want a little bit more hit points. Uh, my intent is to have her master bodybuilding, for reference. Also, I bumped Bo all the way up to 5. Um, I'm planning on increasing that later. High Priest, I've increased Dark and... I think she. I think he already had Dark 4, but I increased Light to 4 as well. Uh, meditation's at 7, so I can go Master Meditation at this point. And that's about it. He's going to be quite skill point deficient for a while. I really wanted to increase these two, but I just couldn't justify it. Um, also, Meditation 7 on Regina. I bumped Air Magic to 5 instead of 4, and increased Dark and Light to 4 each. Matt, Dark and Light 4 each, Meditation 7, Bow up to 4, I had to use a couple of horseshoes for that, and that's about it. Notice how last time I said I was going to increase armor and I didn't touch armor whatsoever? It's because I realized how far back I was on a couple of other things. My next major level up, I'll touch armor. So, um, we need to go... Well, first off, it is Thursday, March 4th. So, we are on a new day, new month. New month meaning it's time for new prayer. Okay, your master, I think Expert Meditation, uh, was that New Serpical or Castle Iron Fist? Uh, do, 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 do. New Serpical, okay. Which is fine. Hello. Is it here? No, that's the training grounds. Hello. So that's fire and earth. This is the three self, if I remember correctly. Through the buccaneer's lair. To the other side? How are you tonight? How are you? Dawson. How are you tonight? There it is. Right, let's go ahead and town portal back to mist to master this. And then I'll show you how big of a bonus master meditation ends up being. Oh, I need personality 30. Okay, that's doable. Um, you have the meditation spell on you. There we go. All right, now. She does not have any spell point regeneration, so... She has gained 115 spell points just from going from one meditation to Master 7 meditation. It is great. So I have way more magic points than I did before, which will help me do lots of other things. That's kind of why I got it. Um, let's see, I need bodybuilding. That's back in New Serpical. I should have just done that while I was here. I remember where bodybuilding's at next to... Yeah. Doink. All right, um, I need Expert Bow, which if I remember right, all of Expert Bow is over in Castle Iron Fist, was it? Darn it. You know what, I'm just going to copy that. Um, Bow is in White Cap or in uh, Iron Fist, okay. So, Beacon, Recall, Iron Fist. None of my beacons are in danger of running out yet. Um, this is down the hill. This one's Knife. This one, Bow? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. 
So now I have expert bow. I need to expert my light and dark. I know that. Is there anything else that I need to go expert? Just light and dark? Okay, well, we know where those two are. We've been to both of them. Silver Cove has light, White Cap has dark. How are you? It's the one back here. Hey yep. Okay. Yes. Okay. All right. Silver Cove has light, so let's go ahead and pop over to Silver Cove. Is it only Silver Cove with light? I'm pretty sure it is. Well, there is a second one, but we're not going to Creek Spire anytime soon. Um, let one of you light magic. Yeah, you're light magic. Okay. Yes. Also, while I'm here, learning master, because I finally got that on all of my characters now. Okay. Oh yeah, out of curiosity. 8656. Yeah, see how much more XP he needs now? So much that I can't do that. That's right, that's a different light magic. I can do that. Okay. Um, that should be it for masteries of things. I'm doing a lot better than I was before now. Also, you'll notice that my mic got reset as Sashanan pointed out to me I had that negative 10 might from that skull pile well, way back, and it goes away on rest. This is the first time I've rested since then. So, yeah, that's a thing. All right. Day... Well, first off, I need to recover my magic. Okay. Um... So, today's Thursday. I can't sail until Sunday. I should double check to make sure that is Sunday. I know it's one day a month, but... Uh, let's see. Boat schedule. Turns out it is... Thursday. It is Thursday. Oh, sweet. Let's go. We're going to go to a place that... Until the first time I beat the game, I had no clue how to even get there. It's over here, if I remember correctly. Oh, Sword in the Stone. I should go pick that up. Might be nice. Yes, that is very nice. That is Crusader or Lionheart, Lionheart Sword, which is the highest tier longsword in the game. Unfortunately, I don't use swords. So what we're looking for is a boat. Also, I don't have Wizard Eye up. That could be bad. Uh, it's to the, my north. Another Lionheart sword? No, that's the champion sword. This is the boat I'm referring to. Okay, so we are at Island Norton. It's Jim Bob, the captain. Great. Um, we're currently at Island North, which is in Silver Cove. Island South is not in Silver Cove. The you can hoist the sail. Arr. Island South is in this scary place. This? Welcome to the eel-infested waters. There's very little here. There's a goblin, barkeep. There's a bunch of monsters. A bunch of monsters that I really don't want to screw around with, basically. And I am permanently setting a beacon here. Not recall. Set. So I never have to fast travel. Or, I can always fast travel here. Yeah. This is nightmare land for me. So what I'm going to be doing is using telekinesis to hit things, because I do not want to be anywhere near here, to be honest. But in this place is Master Light Magic. Um, 
I don't remember exactly where, but I'm pretty sure I'm in the wrong spot. I think it's to the north. There's all sorts of nasty things here. This is the only zone in the map for in or zone in the game where you fight sea serpents. Uh, outside of the arena, if you happen to hit at the right time. Um, oh, uh, somebody asked me, what's with the arena? There's actually no point to the arena in the game. At all. Here we go. This is the part of the town I wanted to go to. You're a laborer. You're a surf with some type of pox on your face. You're, yeah, ancient weapons expertise and a child. You are the highest level item shop in the game. This is why I wanted to make sure I had a good merchant is because I'm going to start hitting these types of places. Speaking of hitting these types of places, I should actually have the beacon set over here. I think this is the area that has Abdul's Discount House of Worship. I love that. I love all of the Abdul's jokes. An empty house. Where was it at? This is a dungeon that you don't want to mess around with until later on in the game. You don't have to either. You could actually do it early. But this isn't the island that has what I'm looking for. Where is it? That is the Sword in the Stone for reference. I'm pretty sure my Day of the Gods isn't going to be enough for me to get it yet. Nope, 128. I need 200 strength to be able to draw from the Sword in the Stone. Telekinesis, hit that to loot it. Because I can use the money. Just look at how much damage I'm taking from all of this. It's nuts. I mean, yeah, I'm just running away from everything, but basically everything can kill me really fast. Okay, it's in the bottom left-hand corner, I think. Water spirits. Those are water elementals. Um, so, interesting thing about fighting things on water. You can't loot them. Because their bodies disappear in water. So there's, n outside of the experience, there's no point in actually fighting things that are in water. Uh, three types of enemies in this zone are water elementals, agyars, fun, and sea monsters. Morax is not enchantable. That's a really nice thing for cell bait. Day of protection would be nice right about now. Um, I am missing a building. Is that the building? That might have been the building. So basically, there's a hermit sitting in the middle of nowhere in this zone. The only point to it is for light magic expert, uh, light magic master. I think the zone was light magic at least. Here it is. Master of Light. A master of light magic is among the most powerful spellcasters in the world. I can improve nearly any expert at master status, but I do not do this lightly. I will teach persons of the highest reputation, living saints. You must be saintly to do this. It costs you nothing and you only need four ranks. Yeah. So, okay. I am doing this now while I have saintly without completing any other quests, and there's good reason for this. Because I will likely not, I will likely be dive bombing my reputation shortly. So let's GTFO. Because, yeah, no, I don't want to deal with that. Okay. So, now that we have become light magic masters. Um, oh, I wanted to. I shouldn't have done that. I should have actually Lloyd's Beaconed recalling eel-infested waters because I wanted to buy stuff from here. Because these have some very nice things. Amulet of Magic, that's nice. Unenchanted Witch Ring. Mm. Uh, 
Unenchanted Defender Helm. Special items. Unenchanted Scarab Ring. Unenchanted Scarab Ring. Unenchanted Ultimate Boots. Ooh, that's actually really nice. Oh, I don't really have the money for it though, do I? Unenchanted Armored Boots. Ah, oh, screw it, I'll buy it anyway. So normally I don't bother buying items for me to use because usually you find loot much better than anything that you buy in a store, but Boots of the Sky are really nice. They're basically one of the better boots in, that you can get. Especially Ultimate Boots are the highest level, highest tier of boots, so it's the highest armor class boots that you get, and that enchantment is extremely nice. So, yeah, um, this is going to get sold. I need to do a lot of enchantment at this point. You'll be wanting Saravas. So, we're going to be leaving from Eel Infested Waters because, ew. Let's go on an enchantment spree. I've got the time. Make sure enchant item is my quick spell before I start doing this. That was already enchanted. Oh, that's right. I still have a bunch of things that are already enchanted. Let me go clear out my knight's inventory before I do anything else. That's right. That is also enchant bait. Forgot to sell that. Okay. That should all go to him. Okay. So might plus 11 versus having a stupid high armor class. I think I would rather have the stupid high armor class. That's enchant bait, isn't it? Uh, I don't remember. Uh, let's see. Weapons. Superior quality and above. That does not help me. Screw it. Easy way to find out. It is. Okay. Yeah, that's a better cloak than what you have. Belt-wise, that's luck. What's your belt? Intellect. It drops his spell points by five because his intellect will be below 100. Um, honestly, take the luck for now. So that's as much distribution as I'm going to do. Check for enchanted stuff. That's enchanted. None of the rest of this stuff is. Okay. Time for lots of enchantment. If it weren't for the fact that I'm probably not editing this video, I'd be skipping things right about now. Ooh, I definitely have some good enchantments in here. Uh, especially this one right here. Um, I want you to have really good resistances. Do you have a ring of resistances right now? You don't, actually. I'm kind of surprised. Well, oh, it's going to replace that one. Uh, there it went. There we go. Scare brings uh, personality, goes to my priest. 
drop that, add the scare, bring a personality, sell that. Cold resistance. Trying to find the crappiest resistance, basically. Eh, honestly, that's not that great. Okay, crown, where are resistance sleep? That's going to be sold. Personality plus eight, nope. Plus five, intellect and personality. Did you have anything that was less than plus five? Yes, you did. There we go. All right. Next set. Oops. I already did that one. Right, and that's all of the weapon. Oh, I already enchanted that, right. That's cell bait, that's cell bait, that's cell bait. Double damage versus demons, double damage versus demons, double damage versus dragons. Well, this is technically better than what um, he has, so. Uh, this is obvious cell bait because I can't use it anywhere else. And let's sell a bunch of weapons. Time to enchant the rest of this. I remember that shield's not enchantable. I just forgot to move it out of his inventory. All right, that's everything. Might plus 12, not useful. Personality plus 7. What are your current boots? Better than that. Electric resistance 8. Yep, you're going to get that. Helmet. Speed and accuracy? Yeah. Yeah. Appearance plus 12 is going to be salvate. Okay. Sell as much as I can here. Then go over here and sell the rest. All right, that covers roughly what I spent. Um, I need to Go restore my magic points again because I drank. Oh, so that is how much I can now restore from the that well. It's kind of silly. Okay. So, and yeah, there was just a fireball that went by. Stupid dragon towers. Maybe I should do that next. Um, no, I need to do silver cove. So, now that I have stupid high reputation, I'm going to trash it really fast. And I'm going to try to do this without committing any major crimes. The way you do this is that you first off go to a place that has a Ba temple and go pray to uh, go donate to it a lot. Each donation to the Ba temple will drop your reputation by 100 points if I remember correctly. We will science this out. I know each kill is minus 100 reputation, but I don't necessarily remember Ba. So 1096, once, 896, so it's 200 each. One, two, three, four. Now I'm down to 96. And it drops to zero at best. So now I have zeroed out my reputation. Why I'm doing this is going to become fairly obvious. Oh, recall, Castle Iron Fist. Need to get this month's quest, which is in Silver Cove. 
uh, this month's prayer. There's a term for it. Religious journey type thing. Can't think of the term now. You can tell how religious I am. Um, pilgrimage. That's what I was thinking of. Personality. Shrine of Personality. I've still not found it yet. Uh, Shrine of Personality is in Silver Cove, which is where I'm going to. Why am I doing anything else? Silver Cove. All right. So. I'm going to do that first. And if I remember correctly, the Shrine of Personality is not something I've seen yet. And I want to say it's down here somewhere. That's enchantable. That's salvate. That's enchantable. That's definite salvate. Nice. That's the only loot on that island. I don't feel like fighting things that are exercises in frustration. You're just a quartermaster. I do not care. I'm dealing with druids that sound like kittens when they die for some reason. Don't ask. Just the way I interpret it. I, yep, that was about to say, I should be hitting the border shortly. This is the shrine. Right? Or is this Cedric Druthers stuff? Nope. This is the obelisk. Yeah, monolith. Do not feel like dealing with gargoyles. Silver Cove, for some reason, is one of the maps I don't remember where everything's at. Can't tell you why. This is where I need to go for the warlord. This is the shrine. All right, plus 10 personality permanently. Druids are very nasty potentially because they have the ability to zero out your MP. Um, not only is that very bad, but if I were to have that happen to me right now, I would fall like a rock if it happened to Regina. Just swooping down to grab loot. Oh, hell yes. So, of the gods, it's one of the best enchantments in the game. It's plus 10 to everything. That's enchantable. Let's get out of here. And actually come to do the quest that I wanted to do. I don't remember where this dungeon was now. Oh, Silver Help Stronghold. Okay. I also have a quest for that. I have all of this uh, quests for this zone. I don't care. I'm going to be traveling anyway. I just need to be careful about my traveling because I want to um, go someplace on March 21st, which is the quest, one of the quests I'm going to go pick up. Lady Loretta Fleece. That is Lady Loretta Fleece. She is the druid person. And her promotion quest is praying at the center of the circle of stone on an equinox or solstice. So the next one being March 20th. This is the reason why I waited to talk with her is because there's not much of a reason to talk with her because you can't even do your druid promotion quest until March 20th. It's the reason why speedrunners will never play with a druid because you can't promote. Um, and really, you can't really promote in most... Um, quick games, shall we say. But, and I also don't have any druids in my party, but the experience will be ra rather nice. Uh, the other quest, her council quest, is money. I happen to know that you are amongst a short list of adventurers looking to receive favor with the high council. 
what you want to f what you want it for i don't know nor do i care i'll be blunt i like money and i want more much more i have a plan to fix the price of shipping in my favor for a time and i need competent agents to carry it out perform this task well and i will give you my support um not to mention a lot of money. Here's the plan. Each of the nine shipping companies in the kingdom must be convinced to charge at least 48 gold per pound per mile of material they transport. They're all in competition and they know it, so none of them will want to make a move before the others. I don't care how you convince them, just get the job done and report back to me. This is a quest that will drop your reputation for completing it. That's the reason why I'm waiting on, um, whatchamacallit, uh, Whatchamacallit, um, hold on a moment. Sorry, I was waiting on somebody. Um, basically, when you complete this quest, your reputation will drop, and I need my reputation lower. Significantly lower. Um... So in order to be able to master dark magic, you need your reputation at the lowest possible point. And that's what I'm going to be doing, is dropping my reputation at this point. So after completing the money quest, I oh, I should complete the great druid quest first, though. But So basically, here's the thing with the money quest. If you do it fast enough, you get a large bonus. And if you do it slow enough, well, you get pretty much nothing. Yeah, she doesn't like it when you talk to anything. When you talk to her after the fact. But anyway, I'm running away before those gargoyles kill me. And what I need to do is start talking with any staple in the game. A lot of them I can reach pretty easily. Like so. And I will be hitting each of the staples that I can reach via town portal. But that's not all of the stables, and that's the problem. There are two stables I cannot reach via town portal. Let's hit... Well, three, actually, if you include um, Castle Iron Fist. But I can hit Castle Iron Fist pretty easily. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do
skip Town Portal GTFO. So is it Blackshire I can recreate expire from? What day is it? Thursday. So um, let me quickly look at the travel schedule. Uh, let's see, I need to get to Kriegspire. I can get there a Friday, it looks like, from Freehaven. Okay, I can do that. Just means another day. Okay. Um, while we're here, we could explore Blackshire some. So Blackshire is a very nice place because I'm buying at nearly cost, which is nice. So I can get some in plate mail to enchant. Uh, I need to check. I need to figure out why my monitor keeps blinking. That was a special. This is the regular. No room. Mm. I will make room. Blinked again. Okay, this is ridiculous. I'm not moving the table. Oh yeah, I forgot to actually equip the Shield of the Gods. Um, buy more plate mail. This is now your baby. And this is now yours. Oops, this goes back to you. Move that back over so I have any space at all. Enchant, enchant, sell. Okay, that should be good. That's actually where the um, shrine is for the zone. It's fairly easy to reach. Ah, blinking. Yep, there's even a townsperson all the way up there. Trading post, which has crappy things. You can restore spell points really easily here. This is also where Master Dark Magic is, isn't it? Uh, why is it blinking so much? Dark Magic Expert, okay. Which I already have. Where was Dark Magic Master? Was that in... Paradise Valley, yeah, that's going to be obnoxious to get at. So both Guild of Light and Guild of Darkness is here, which is interesting. This is the statuette quest, which I can pick up. Um, basically, Twyland's trying to reverse the effects of aging and needs three statues placed on three specific pillars. Um, and the statues are here. Or five statues, sorry. We've actually seen one of the pillars already. I just haven't done anything with it. Hello. You are a Smuggler's Guild membership, which I'm already a member of, with a kid. Oh, yes. Empty house, for no reason. You know how it is. Item Guild. Oh, I spent too much time, didn't I? Yep. Dang it. Oh well. I wanted to actually buy stuff from there. Why are you doing that it's flickering a bunch so these halberds I can actually enchant Two fifties the limit these are all spears Yeah, I'm not going to fit Jack Squat in there. Yeah, that's pretty much all I'm going to fit in. Well, I can fit in two instead of one, but... I need to get the armor out. Anyway, as I'm looking around, um, you're a factor. 
You're an arms master. You're the trainer. I don't have a fly up. How dare I? Hello. You have a quest. Our town is under a terrible curse, though most of the people don't believe it. Under a full moon, we all change into werewolves. Although none of us are truly evil, we don't know what sorts of horrible things we do as werewolves. We can't approach our lord Acton Spelter about this problem because he doesn't realize that we are the werewolves. Please find a way to turn us back to normal. So, the town wants you to deal with werewolves. Of course, I missed that too. Great. This is where Master Mace training is. Requires rank 8 and 40 might. I'm probably not getting that anytime soon, if ever. To meet you. Master Sword is here. You just need rank 8 and be a Cavalier. I am a Cavalier, but I'm not going to be using Sword this game, so I didn't bother putting any points into it. Empty building. Master Shield Defense. I'm probably not going to do any sh Master Shield this game, but I don't know. It's possible. Hello. Yet another quest. My husband, Emmanuel, went to Star Island a few weeks ago with a few friends, hoping to find some treasure. I haven't seen him since, and I'm worried about him. I don't dare, dare go to the island. It's rumored to be home of Medusas. If you can find him and bring him home, I would be very grateful. And yeah, it's not just rumored to be home of Medusas. It totally has Medusas in it. Um, I just woke up some angry things. Oh. I can fight them flying without too much of an issue. They're not too bad at this point. I just need to be careful so I don't hit any civilians. Also, greater werewolves are nasty. I must have gotten hit by a fireball. Yeah, greater werewolves are nasty pieces of work. Nasty pieces of work. I could have just fireballed. Fireball. You weaker to acid burst? No. You are stronger against acid burst. This does not surprise me. I'm doing really about the same amount of damage. There we go. There we go. We killed some werewolves. Yay! Werewolves are worth money, which is good. The dungeon back there. I'm not going there. Found a book of learning. Protection poison. I already know it. So werewolves drop random items, basically. I, it might be random accessory style items. That much I don't remember. Hey, good to see you. yeah, you're just a horseman. Okay. So we've kind of grabbed everything that we could from here at this time. I've got a crap tons of things to enchant. Ah, let's see, is there much of a reason for me to stay here? Well, the thing in front of me is a good reason to stay here, actually. Let's enchant some more. got cell bait. Oh, I have no inventory space again. I can... God damn it. Why am I having so many problems with display right now? Well, I need a town portal anyway. Because I don't want to sell things at such high prices. I want to sell them at low prices. Buy high, sell low. 
I did not make money off of that. Yeah, I'm not really making that much money at the moment. That's unfortunate. Sell bait, sell bait, sell bait, sell bait, and sell bait. Yeah, I need to get my merchant skill even higher to have this make a whole bunch of sense. And part of what I'm doing by buying and selling items like that is that I'm getting a chance of finding something awesome also. Okay. So, um... Do things bad quests. Oh, this is where I wanted to return the candelabra at. And I probably should have now. Uh, let's see. What am I looking at quest log wise? Well, I need to get to Creek Spire, which is going to be tomorrow. So I've got a day to kill. What can I handle in a day? Could technically go take out a dragon. Why not? Well, it requires me to go to my least favorite zone in the game. Fly and GTFO. This is the most annoying dungeon in the game for reference, is over here. So the reason why this is so bad isn't just because there's lots of undead, it's the fact that there's civilians as well. is with the damn blinking. Okay. Day of the Gods. Day of Protection. And here is Longfang with her hide. You want to fight a dragon? Let's fight a dragon. This dragon will actually be fighting. Hopefully YouTube will actually get this as a screen, as a thumbnail, because that would be pretty sweet. So, um... I think... I think this should work the way I want it to. Um, okay, it's not weak to poison, or not strong against poison. Um, trap metal. Trap metal did very little damage, unfortunately. I did one point of damage with a sword, or an axe, so obviously my minimum damage should be below one. What that indicates is that this has physical resistance. Pretty much everything in the game at higher levels has physical resistance or physical immunity. Or in short, stop trying to hit it with an axe. Um, I'm pretty sure you're, yeah, you're immune to fire. That's to be expected. Um, the Might Magic 7 early dragon's not immune to fire, strangely. You actually didn't do as much damage as I was hoping you would. Um, I want to feeble mind you. That didn't work. Okay, you're going to be on Sparks duty. Unfortunately, it's not much in the way of damage, but it's the best I've got. Um, before. Yeah, I'm not doing enough damage with Poison Spray. I need to use Stronger. Um, Trap Metal is definitely stronger, but I'm not high enough level to do super awesome damage with it. Sparks. Um, I caused fear. That was not something I was expecting to be able to do. Okay. Now fear is gone because I attacked it, and that's expected. So that means people mind's not working. Would have been nice, but you know.
So it does have ice resistance, because that's below minimum damage again. Dragons are just annoying. Um... Bless. Haste. Because I forgot to cast that. Oh. I'm doing fairly well. Honestly, Lung Fang is actually not that hard. It's probably the easiest dragon in the game because you're by yourself. You don't have to worry about anything else. And now Longfang is dead. Does this give me loot like a dragon? No, it doesn't. Drat. And also, I am picking up every one of these bones. Because I want to lose lots of reputation. Okay. Did that. We now have a dead dragon. Hooray. Let's town portal to Freehaven, where somebody wants bones. Uh, this one over here is teeth, isn't it? Isn't this the teeth lady? Hello. Yep, that's the teeth lady. Where's the bones person? Who wanted the bones? Oh yeah, other thing I wanted to do. Let's find some negative NPCs to drop my reputation down further. Cooper... Beggar, Apprentice, well, let me guess, now I'm not going to be able to find thieves and so on. If you're a bard, I definitely don't want you right now. Hello. Water Master, ID Item Master, which is not at all helpful. Let's see. So this is the yell command, it makes people move out of the way supposed to drop your reputation but I'm not seeing any signs of it whatsoever maybe it only drops it down to average arms master Taylor mystic Taylor navigator merchant tracker oops stone cutter I know there's a thief over here trapper Smith But I can't hire that burglar. Stonecutter. Pirate. That's one of them. Let's see. Let's get rid of the... Teacher. I'm going to end up getting rid of both of them temporarily. Pirate. Join me. Arr. So Reputation decreased by a full category. So... Woohoo! Minus 200! I need to get to minus 1,000, I think it was. How are you? Yeah, you're a trainer. I don't care about that right now. Noble, chimney sweep, merchant, cobbler, rustler, bard, squire, apprentice. Does the rustler count as a negative one right now? Also, having to threaten somebody drops reputation by 50. It's great. Begging drops it by 10. Notice how they're talking very differently now. It's because I have a negative reputation. Seventy. Hey you. Hey you. Hey you. Hey you. Yeah, 
I'm not seeing an NPC that I want. I want another negative reputation NPC. Hey, you. Hey, you. Hey, you. Hey, you. It worked. It worked. Yep, now my reputation's vile. I can remember where I need to sell off the bones, which probably is behind me, if anywhere. Hey, you. Oops. Hey, you. So I'm intentionally trying to talk to people to drop my reputation, because I want to hit as low as possible without... What I'm trying to do is do this without actually doing any crime, because that's just wrong. Bribe. Bribe doesn't drop it by that much. But I have a vile reputation now. Okay. I know if I sell the bones, it counts as committing a crime. Um, what can I do while I'm here? I'm weak. Oh, haste, right. Like, wait, why am I weak? Yeah. Okay, I can go do the second druid quest, basically. But that's going to take time. Um, I'm about out of time, so this is probably where I'm going to stop. Just going to finish healing back up. Damn it, did the wrong character. Okay, um, yeah. We're being mean. Very mean. Ooh, I'm a mean person. Rawr, mean. Duper will totally count. Okay, so dupers will also decrease reputation. Let's dismiss Erwin. Join higher. Now our reputation is despicable. You're despicable. There's the fireball coming in. I really need to actually finish that damn quest. Um, so that's probably about as low as I'm going to get until I finish Loretta Fleece's quest. I need to wait a day still. Where can I even go? Um that I haven't been to. I can start doing things in White Cap, Silver Cove. I've finished off pretty much everywhere else. So New Serpical has something there, but it's nasty. I don't want to deal with it. Mist is done. Castle Iron Fist is done. Silver Cove is far from done. Freehaven's done outside of the one dungeon that I guess I could actually go do that. That'll make it easier for me to just jump back here later. Oh, um, let me go see if I can buy another Lloyd's Beacon. So that will be handy. I think I've already been here, so I can't. But let's find out. Oh. Okay. Guess I won't do that. Because I'll be traveling tomorrow, so there's not much of a reason for me to do anything else. I want a second Lloyd's Beacon because I'm going to start running out of beaconable spots. And it's really handy to have somebody else for your temporary stuff. So I guess I will stop here and start the next video entering the Temple of the Moon. Hope you've enjoyed this video and I will see you next time. And bye.